10 Republican state senators, including Tim Canope, no longer able to run for re-election. I don't think anybody's going to argue with the fact that there um, are no Republicans on that court because there aren't and there are no conservatives either. And so I, I, I'm not really surprised by um, the decision. In a historic move, the Oregon State Supreme Court upholding Measure 113, the bill approved by 68% of voters disqualifying any legislator from running for re-election after 10 unexcused absences from the legislative floor. You can and never convince me when it says the election after your current term is completed applies to election that takes place before your term is completed. That's just, uh, quite frankly, it's ridiculous. So, um, yeah, clearly I don't agree with the decision. The race for District 27 is now between Bend City Councilor Anthony Broadman and Executive Director for the Downtown Bend Business Association, Shannon Monahan. Really grateful to the Supreme Court for upholding the will of the voters. I think it was pretty clear what we voted on. We expect our public servants, whether they be teachers or nurses or um, firefighters or police officers, we expect a lot of them, and I think it's fair for us to expect the same from uh, our elected officials. Canope endorsed Monahan to replace him. She did not respond to our request for comment on Thursday. But the real question is, what's your opinion on the decision? I think it's all uh, politically motivated, really. Uh, Tim Canope has always taken care of us as a Republican, and uh, they had the right to do what they, in my opinion, of course, they had the right to do what they wanted to do because they have beliefs just like everybody does. I feel like they should not be able to run. If they're not following the rules, they should not be able to enforce rules upon others. No, I think it's really criminal. Um, the Democrats have been out of their seats years in the past and no repercussions. So I think this is not right. I think that Republicans are getting a bad rap. 